Ah uh, yes, my fellow Mugen enthusiasts, it's that time where your boy is gonna be talking about a certain Mugen that just came out like a couple of days ago. Now this Mugen, we have been praying for it. We've been praying for this version to come out, and that version is none other than Bleach versus Naoto 4.0. Let's go! 4.0, let's go! What is the demo version? What? What the fuck? Yeah, it, it sucks. It's the demo version. The full release is not yet out, so we get with the demo, and the demo. You can already see it's looking good. If you want, if you want the game, link is in the description below. Go download it, go play it, go enjoy it, and all that crap. This game is really good. Like when Kizuma Gaming released it, he released the PC version and the Android version. So if you wanted the PC version, just head on over to Kizuma Gaming's channel. Now, when he first released, when the when it came out, it was a little laggy, so they had to refix it and then release the demo version. So that's why it looks a little laggy, but it's okay, and it looks good. From how the menu looks like, from the character list to the health bar, everything, even like the controls are marvelous. It's a whopping 10 out of 10. This is the type of thing that we need in Bleach versus Naruto. This is the type of thing that we need. Now you already know I'm a generic uh, Bleach versus Naruto uh, gamer. You know I'm a Bleach versus Naruto fan. So the first thing that comes to your mind is, hey yo. With this, your boy can probably add dope characters into this mod and you know, get to see how it looks like. Now I went over to app editor so I can see if I can add characters and into this mod, into this version. And this may, and this may surprise you. Again, you, this may surprise you. You cannot add characters in this mod. No, no, no. Fuck! Shit! Like, at all. You cannot. Yeah, that's right, people. 4.0, you cannot add characters into the map. You can't even add a, a text, map, nothing. You can't do that. You can't even remove a character from that. It's impossible. L you can see, like, look at that, bro. You go through all the process to go there. It's nothing. The, the folder, the fight folder, the map folder, it, it's nowhere to be found. I don't know where the heck that thing is. I was so thoroughly disappointed. I'm like, ah, oh, Christ! This is like the second Mugen app. This is the second Blue Fist Naruto app that does not allow you to add characters into the into the game. The first one is the Bear Brains or Bear Brains version. If I, I, I if I said it. If I said it incorrectly, I'm sorry I butchered that name. I totally butchered it, but the name's on the screen. Bear Brian's or Bear Brian's, you, you, the one that had the watch mode. I made a video specifically saying that you cannot add characters into that shit because the ca and you cannot even remove them and add those characters, the ones that you removed from that version into your own, into your other mod. You cannot because the characters are not in SWF, which that pisses you off because it's the only mod that has a watch mode and yet you cannot add characters and you know see them duke it out. You just cannot. Now 4.0 is the exact same thing. Now when you see this shit, you like. You think to yourself, ah, the future of 4.0 is not looking bright. It's not looking all that bright, my guy. It's not looking that all that bright because this is just a demo. Imagine how, imagine the, imagine the actual release when it comes out. What will people think? They'll be like, okay, cool. It, 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 it's all right. We're going to, people are going to download it. Yes, people are going to enjoy it, but it's not going to last because you can't add gadgets into that it'll get boring you can't even add maps i mean the maps they are gorgeous look at that look at that they are gorgeous but if you can't add carry your favorite characters into a mod then what's the point of getting it you ask yourself okay cool we got 4.0 nice great but if we can't add characters into it then what's 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 the point this is what's holding us back this is what's, hold, what's gonna hold us back if this type of mod come out 
we are going to be stuck in the 3.3 era. We're going to stuck we're going to be stuck in the Bleach versus Naruto 3.3 era we're gonna be stuck in the 3.3 era and the 3.3 is not so that it's not bad but you want something new you know and the 4.0 is something new and yet disappointed you can't add characters or nothing that's just that's shit i mean tell me what you guys think about the 4.0 because i love the 4.0 and at the same time i just hate what they what they're doing right now i honestly have nothing to say if you've reached this part of the video thank you so much please do make sure to like comment and subscribe and do comment do comment tell me what you guys think about this mod because this mod is not looking all that is not looking all that good for us it's definitely not looking good for us if we can add characters into in the um in in the android version do you think we can add characters into the pc version i don't know who, who knows who knows man who knows because in the pc version they have they, when they make mods they, you are obviously you can add characters into that but this one just won't let you damn so uh yeah let me know what you guys think and once again please do make sure to like comment and subscribe especially the returning viewers I would appreciate it if, it, if there's any update, I'll make a video, but uh, yeah, this this has been your boy Otaku J Rider, peace, deuces, bye bye, and don't forget to keep on playing Mugen, yeah, yeah.